my channel and welcome to a little belated blind bag monday today with the first easter related a uh, little belated surprise egg video uh we got a chocolate surprise egg uh, from my little pony which i got today in my toy hunt uh which will be up later uh, i got a little mole egg with one of those little mole figurines in we al already opened some of before uh we got a maya the bee egg and I bought two, uh, I believe, Spanish or Italian surprise eggs uh, with uh, un safari di sorpresa. Uh, so it, it should contain a safari surprise. So I believe an animal figurine. I hope an animal figurine because they weren't that ex uh, they weren't that cheap. Uh, they were about two fifty each. I don't know, uh, but they weren't that cheap. So we got those five eggs today. And also today, International Crafts Month is starting, uh, so I put my little, uh, like, the bunny, uh, the, the white rabbit from Alice in there, and some eggs I've done, so happy International Crafts Month to all you guys, you creative guys out there. Um, then let's start with the Maya the Bee egg. Because this is about the eggs, not me talking. Oh, it's delicious white and dark chocolate, or white and milk chocolate. Uh, let's see. And it's a pretty dark green capsule inside. And oh look, we got this is these are figurines. Oh, these are not junk eggs. These are really cute figurines. So let's have first. Let's have a look at the flyer. So at first we got this little ant. Then we got Maya. Then we got Flick. I don't know the names in English. I know the names in German. I hope they are the same. Uh, we got Cassandra, Maya. We got Kurt. Uh, we got Maya again. We got Willy. We got a snail. And I believe this should be... This should be Puck the Fly. Is that Puck the Fly? Looks like Puck the Fly. Really cute. And we got one of the Mayas. So let's put her on her little stand. And look at her. It's a really skeptical cook looking one. Um, but they're kind of cool. Okay, doesn't stand that well on her stand. Please. Thanks. They look cool. Better than the series, the new CGI series. I don't like CGI, the CGI series at all. But the figurines are cute. They almost look like the vintage ones. So let's put her in the cross. Um, and go on with the little mole egg. I already got a few figurines from that series and I hope to get a new one. I bought these in the Chesh Republic. Uh, because the little mole is a Chesh character. Uh, we got some dextrosy candy inside from Dixie. And nope, got that mole. Already got that mole. So this is a double for me. Why are you so cute? Look at the little moon. Now let's put the green egg back into the Easter decorations. Um, I will open the My Little Pony egg last uh, because I'm really hoping to get something cool out of it. Because it was really expensive. What about seven bucks I believe. I hope there's something good inside. So let's get one of the Italian or Spanish eggs. Only says on the flyer un safari di sorpresa, so there should be something safari related in there. Uh, there's no checklist or something, so I don't know what's inside. So they're beautiful wrapped, by the way, in this cool safari paper. And the egg is already broken, so let's keep the paper on the table. Um, so there's the egg. Actually, it's broken and melted inside. So let's break it a little bit more. Okay, so the capsule and the chocolate are building one unit. Let's see if we can get it. Of, yep. Yeah. Popped off, perfect. Chocolate is actually quite delicious. Just taste it a bit. Oh. 
please stay so inside is a little toy yeah it's okay they used like these toys you can get on aliexpress or uh some of these cheap websites from china and just put it in a chocolate egg so that's a pretty cool trick uh to like sell a chocolate egg so actually this is a pretty cheap animal figurine kind of looks like a mammoth uh, doesn't really look like an elephant the one leg is bent over um it's a harder rubbery material uh not that great in detail and color uh definitely not worth the money but it's a cute toy Cheap animal figurine. And there's no checklist. So let's see if we got an elephant again. Uh, which one is inside of this one? Of course, will be the same exactly cheap made figurine. And the capsule again. And it's, oh, it's a zebra. Again, one of these little cheap toys you can get, get from every Chinese wholesaler for like just a few cents each. And again, totally bent over legs and not well detailed, not well made. So ugly. It actually doesn't look like zebra stripes. Uh, that looks more like a tiger. So at first I thought it was a tiger, white tiger. Um, doesn't look like a zebra at all. Uh, yep. We'll never ever buy eggs from this company again. Olaf is smiling. And we're coming to the exciting part of this video. The My Little Pony Giant Chocolate Egg. I really love the wrapper, but I can't keep every food item, uh, especially because we open it, it won't stay in that shape. So let's get rid of that. And then we got the perfectly twilight sparkly colored uh, wrapper. And I believe this is a little, yeah, this is a little cloth cord, uh, cord to hold it together. So let's cut that real quick. And have a look inside. Kinder Surprise was doing these acts uh, back in the 90s. Uh, I really was excited for them. Every Easter and we were driving to France extra to get these eggs uh, because they only were sold in France and Luxembourg and Belgium. And we got some cheap ones over here. So let's have a look inside. Oh my God, look guys, it's a giant capsule. So as I said, this egg was about seven bucks or six bucks uh, in Euro, which should be about seven dollar. Um, hopefully there's something good inside. Oh my gosh, look what they put inside. Look what they put in! I'm, I'm. Oh my gosh! I definitely have to put this on MLPmerch.com. Oh my gosh! Let me just get my other pass dispenser. So this is the regular uh, pass dispenser from Pinkie Pie, which you can buy in every store throughout the the entire planet. And this is a tiny pass dispenser. I knew. That they had one for, uh, some from Disney and some Easter ones and some stuff like that. But there was no information on the internet or from Paz uh, that they made tiny ones of them. Oh my gosh. That's so cute. Now we got a big Pinkie Pie one and a small Pinkie Pie one. Oh my gosh. And I was so lucky because Pinkie Pie is my favorite pony. There was a really successful toy hunt today. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about this. 
Wow, this made my day. So guys, that's it for today. That's the little belated blind bag Monday video. Uh, the chick already fell down. The eggs are falling down. Uh, the cheap animals will go into like a cheap animal box. I don't know. Have a great first day of spring. And look forward to another Easter related blind bag video next Monday. I hope you enjoyed this one. I really love the little pinkie pie. I definitely have to put it on MLP merch right now uh, because it's really awesome. Be sure to subscribe my channel and follow me on any social media thing. Links are down in the description box below. Thanks so much for watching. I love you guys and see you real soon. <laughs>